Sky TV 4 News at 5 starts now. Breaking news right now. The suspect in a double police shooting on the Big Island has just been taken into custody. I'm Yenji Denise. Paula Akana has the night off. The officers were shot in an ambush in an attack they never saw coming. KITV Force Kenny Choi has our breaking news in this double shooting. Kenny. Yanji, the suspect is 31-year-old Kiaka Martin of Hilo. When police went to a house shortly before 3.30 this afternoon, they heard a gunshot inside the house. They then found Martin with a self-inflicted gunshot wound to the chest. Police say that the original shooting last night involving the two police officers happened on Kilauea Avenue in Hilo. A man started firing shots, hitting two on-duty police officers, and then Martin fled the scene, according to police. Shortly before 9 last night, while responding to gunshots heard, police officers approached a man hiding under a parked car. Both officers were fired upon and sustained gunshot injuries. One of the officers was able to return fire. Both officers were shot in the legs. They underwent surgery at the Hilo Medical Center and are now listed in stable condition. The officers are identified as a 40-year-old, 14-year veteran, and the second officer, a 31-year-old, 4-year veteran of the Hawaii Police Department. Now, Hawaii County Police did not release the names of the officers involved in the shooting last night. They did confirm, however, that the last time one of their police officers were involved in a shooting was back in 2009. Now, the suspect, Martin, was taken to the hospital in critical condition this afternoon. Yanji? Kenny Choi leading us off with that breaking news. Thank you, Kenny.